The way that, you know, when you're a high net worth individual, the way things are owned is very tricky. You know, you don't want, you know, no high net worth individual has everything in his name. Let's just put it that way. But it's complicated the way things are owned. So sometimes people will ask me, they'll, there'll be five cars on the drive and, you know, girls especially who are naive to these things will be like, which ones are yours and which ones are Andrew's? My honest answer is I don't actually know. <laughs> Let me, I have to look at the papers to work out exactly what, but it, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. The keys are in this box, in that room, and we can drive them whenever we like. And we never argue because there's so many. You know? And when you build that abundance and you build yourself to the level of wealth me and Andrew are at, what are we going to argue about? There were times when we were kickboxing where we didn't have money for food. We used to eat cans of sardines. And there have been times splitting our last can over plain rice. Mm -hmm. So now people are like, oh, it's weird that you share a house with your brother. I'm like, it's weird that you don't. You know, I used to share my last can of food with him. And now we can't live in the same house. I've got nine bedrooms.